morning friends and happy Wednesday. Uh, today is one of those days where I'm just staying home and getting a few things done around the house. Um, I just finished up the guest bedroom. I still have a few things that are laying around in there that I need to get cleaned up. But I actually remembered that we are going to actually have guests coming before Brian's cousin comes in October. And I actually said September yesterday in the video, and when I was re-watching it after I had edited it again, um, I missed that. <laughs> and I'm like, oh gosh, oh well. Um, but no, our cruise is in October. Brian's family is coming in September. No, Brian's, coming, Brian's family is coming in September, the first week of October. And then the second week of October, Brian's cousin will be in, and then we're leaving for our trip. So, anyway, that's all done. At least the bed's clean and ready for the next guest, whoever that shall be, whenever that shall be. Um, whew, but I have been busy um, all morning. Um, I've been doing some clothes. I actually have some clothes right here in the basket that I just laid there that I have to toss on the bed and start folding. So that's what I'm gonna do today. It's a cloudy, gloomy, rainy, yucky day, so perfect day to stay in and get some stuff done. It seems like there's always something to do around the house. There's always something to clean, mop, dust, vacuum, laundry. There's always something. So obviously I'm always busy doing something every single day. Um, but there are days too where I just want to be like, you know, I don't feel like getting up off the couch and I don't feel like doing anything. Um, and I just want to watch movies all day. And today's kind of one of those days, but um, I, have, I have some energy and then I need to like, you know, burn it off. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, so I'm going to be folding these clothes here shortly. And I've actually been watching um, the episodes of Shameless. I love that show. Uh, so I've actually kind of started watching it from the beginning. See how dark it is out here? It is like super dark outside. It's like been yucky, raining, we're having flash flooding, all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, that stuff I'm probably going to carry, I'm not going to carry that up to the man cave today because that stuff right there, that's because it's raining outside and obviously I'm not going to go out there while it's raining. So hopefully it'll be one of those things that I get cleaned up um, or put up maybe this weekend. Um, the next thing I want to start cleaning up today is um, Wonderland headquarters and, oh gosh, the other thing that I've been wanting to do and I have on my list to do, which I'll probably get done today, is I want to pull out the stuff from underneath my sink in my bathroom and I want to go through all of that and I want to see what I can get rid of, what I need to keep, and all that good stuff. So that's probably what I'll end up doing like this afternoon. But first I'm going to try to fold some of these clothes and put those away and then I'll probably have some lunch and then I'm going to start on my under the sink in my bathroom. Yeah, I think I'll do that first instead of doing Wonderland Headquarters. I might actually take that stuff into Wonderland Headquarters and do it in there, there's quite a bit. Um, oh well, I'll figure it out and obviously I will take you guys along. Alrighty, so I am in my bathroom and I actually started cleaning out the cabinet and stuff already and just kind of started putting like things in groups, um, things that I'm like it's expired and things that I'm not gonna use anymore, or things that are half used, I'm just gonna toss. Um, I have stuff that I'm going to keep and obviously stuff that I need to like store and put away. Um, but this is how I have it so far. Um, this is like stuff that, um, has expired or I'm just going to get rid of. Um, and then this is the stuff like right here that I need to keep right here. And then this is the stuff that I need to keep as well. And that's like extra stuff. Um, shave, gel, toothpaste, etc., etc., etc. And then down here is what I've had in um, my area. So I'm going to pull this out and we'll go through this in just a second. Let me pull this out because it'll make a loud noise All if right, I don't so do I it. So I moved right. it to the kitchen. Um, that way I have better lighting and I can stand up and not bend, be bending over. Okay, so this is, um, it's got spray paint all over it. Um, but anyway, uh, this is what's been in here. Just some like, uh, Kleenexes. Look, another little pouch thingy that I am obsessed with. So I'm obsessed with pouches, but I like that one. That's a nice one. And then all of these. These are like soaps and stuff from Disney. All of these are going to get tossed. I do not need any of these. Um, I don't know why I was obsessed. Um, 
Oops, that wasn't supposed to happen, <laughs> but it did. All right, so now that I got to clean all, all the right, stuff. All right, so on to the second drawer, and to avoid that from happening, I'm just gonna put it up here. Okay, so this, like, I don't need this barrette. I don't need, this says Go Dogs. I don't need it, it's old, throw it away. Um, guys, these are a collection of watches that I have. I used to wear like a watch to match every outfit all the time, every day, like crazy every day. Um, and obviously you guys can see, I don't ever wear watches anymore, but look, I had a watch to match every outfit. I loved my watches. I thought they were so cool. I had some that were like, like, look at this one. It's got like a bubble face. It's like bubbled. It's, I love it. So pretty. Um, all of them are probably dead. Um, I'm curious to know if I put these on posh, would somebody want them? Because I could just sell them all for, you know, 30 bucks or something. And look how cool this face was. That was a cool face. I love that one. That was a neat face. Um, I had another pink one. Loved that one. Um, I loved my M&M one. Super cute. I loved this one because it was like so blingy. Um, yeah, I had just had so many. I love, oh, and look at this face. I love that one. Um, but yeah, this is something that I, years ago I had. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this aside and I'm going to lay them all out and take a picture and see if I can post them on Posh. Again, they probably just need batteries, but, and they all probably, they all still work. I'm pretty sure. Um, like I said, they just probably all need batteries. And then for the bottom drawer, <laughs> oh Lord, you guys. Okay. So basically some of this stuff I will be keeping because obviously this is really good travel stuff. Like I will keep the baby oil. I will keep the, oh, it's almost empty. So no. Um, what is this? This is self tan. Throw it away. Um, this is, I don't like that shampoo. I don't like that shampoo. Um, I don't need that. Um, this is, I don't know, I kind of like that. Oh, that's a good um, everyday head and shoulders. That's good. Oh, good. Look, mouthwash. Look, I'm finding all kinds of nice little travel accessories. Um, I don't need that. What is this? Classic conditioner. I'm going to toss it because I don't need it. There's hand sanitizer. We'll keep that. I don't need those. Um, facial cleanser. Throwing it out. Don't need that. Um, don't need that. This is more head and shoulders. I'll keep that because this is really good stuff to travel for, um, especially for when we go on our cruise. So that's really good to have handy. Um, I'm actually going to toss these, even though how cute are these Mickey shampoos? I mean, these were like highly sought after Mickey shampoos. Oh, bye bye. Um, yeah, cleaning that out. That one's gone. Um, what is this? Hairspray? Gone gone you guys see if i haven't used this in like forever then guess what i'm not using it anymore and like it's been down there for years never using it old gonna get rid of it there's a needle in here this is from when i worked probably carried it in my pocket home toss it a brush toss it okay so this is the funniest thing this my friends is a condom and this is a see what it says nyc condom i got this in new york city when i was in when i went to new york in 2009 we went up to this building and <laughs> this building um when you go inside i don't know the, ele the elevator they had these sitting in a basket a ton of these in a basket in new york i just thought that was the funniest thing um look it expires uh 2011 and i i just wanted it obviously because it said New York City condom on it. So obviously I think that's hilarious. So I'm probably gonna keep it. I mean, we don't. <laughs> okay, we don't use it, obviously. Oh, that's out of camera. We don't use it, um, obviously. But I, again, I just kind of wanted it because um, I. Um, it's from New York. I mean, come on. It's a New York City condom. Who wouldn't want to keep condom? <laughs> All right, I'm keeping the condom. It's because I went to New York City. That's funny. I think it's hilarious. Okay, so these are things that I'm keeping. So these are small, like, travel size, sample size things that I'm going to keep. Okay, so that's good. That's going to go back in the drawer here. Um, I'm actually going to keep these, too, because these are really good to keep with you when you're traveling. So I'll keep those. Actually, I'll probably put those in the top here. All righty. So let me get these. I'll sort it out, and I'm going to take a picture. I'm going to post them on Posh. And yeah, I'll see how those from again. Okay, so I laid out all of the watches. So here are the collection of watches that I had. 
And then I just took a picture of them like this and then I posted them on my uh, posh uh, closet. Um, again, I, I told the truth. Obviously, I'm not gonna like lie about it, but um, all of them just need batteries. And um, last I knew, all of them worked because I wore them up until we, up until about 10 years ago when we moved. And then um, they just kind of lost all style, I suppose. I stopped wearing them, but anyway. There's my little collection. So I'm gonna actually put them inside of this uh, Ziploc bag. And then if somebody actually buys them, then I will um, send them to them in this. Alrighty, so, so now that this is pretty much cleaned out, um, I'm gonna go take this back and put it in uh, my cabinet. I don't know if I wanna put it back in my cabinet. I think I might just take it to my, um, my back bedroom. So I think for now I'm just gonna leave it here and now I'm gonna go back All right, to my bedroom. So now I pulled out this little basket and again, this just kind of has stuff in here that's probably half used, which obviously I'll keep nail polish remover. Um, I will keep my um, No More Tangle stuff. Um, I'll probably just end up in this, this one smells nice. I'll have to smell it and see. Um, look, I have half used. I'm gonna put this in my shower now because then I can finish using that up. Um, this is Dove exfoliating. This is body wash. I'll keep because Brian likes that. These powders I've had forever. So I think I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these. Um, this one and this one. I have more shower or shave gel in here. So now I have two of those. See, I don't know what I have in here anymore. Is this an, oh, is this the same one I just had? Italian citrus. Um, what is this? Oh, this is a travel hairspray. Perfect. I needed a travel hairspray. Um, let's put that up here. Um, I have another one of these little smell thingies from Bath and Body Works. This is some cream body wash. Obviously, I'll keep this for body wash. This is body wash. I'll keep that. Um, this is shampoo. Shampoo. I use this for um, washing my uh, makeup brushes. That's what I use this for. So I'll definitely keep this. Um, I'm going to get rid of this shampoo. Because it's half gone anyway. I'm going to get rid of this one. Don't need it. I'm going to get rid of this. These ones just kind of been sitting in here and I don't need them. Um, this is makeup brush shampoo as well. Um, this stuff was actually so crappy. I didn't really like it when I was using it. This is from Sephora. Um, I would actually just prefer the um, baby shampoo. So I'm going to end up tossing this as well. Um, what is this? This is... Uh, blow out, blow, fruities, full and plush, voluptuous blow out. Nope, tossing it. This is body cream, tossing it. I'm gonna toss these and toss these. Okay, good. Okay, so I basically, and I'm just gonna put this stuff back in here. Um, this probably needs to be wiped out. Nope, I think that's stuck on there. Okay, I'm just gonna put this stuff back in here. I'm gonna keep this stuff. I do like these for like, spraying around the house. So I'll keep that. I'm gonna put this in my shower now. So I'm gonna put that up there. Um, this is more body gel, shower gel, blah, 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 blah. Um, here's extras. This is for um, my hair. I like to do this like once a month. This keeps my hair really blonde in between my um, salon visits. Um, I have two of these, obviously. So I'm gonna keep those in here. Um, let's see, this is all travel stuff. These are extras right here. This is my blow dry it. So now I know I have two of these extra, which is nice. I have an extra hairspray, which is good. Um, I have my baby oil, which is great. Um, this is like a self tanner. Mm, I'm gonna keep this for a little bit longer. I might need it. Um, this is gonna be, I'm gonna put this probably in my travel bag. Um, for my travels coming up very soon and then obviously this is extra deodorant which I'll probably put in that I don't know we'll keep it right here for now so for now I'm just going to put this back up underneath Alrighty. my cabinet. so the next thing that I'm going to clean out is this little basket that I have all of my um, hair products or hair styling stuff in this is a straightener that I use when I straighten my hair I love this width um, so I'm definitely going to be keeping that um, here are some of those little um, gloves that I have for those wands that I will probably never use because they are this one is the one I got at Christmas time and it is um, the side, the barrel is too small. It's like a really, really tiny barrel. So I probably am gonna put this on Posh as well. 
um, and I actually have the glove right here that goes with it. That's like a $100 um, wand. And then I have this wand right here that I probably bought Oh, it's bedhead, so probably bought it at Target or Walmart, which I'm going to keep this because I still want to practice that. And then there's the little um, glove that comes with that one. Um, this is just a huge barrel curling iron that did not do me justice. That's why I ended up getting another one. So um, I'm going to end up probably taking that to the Goodwill. Um, I'll take this to the Goodwill as well because that this size, I just don't need this size. Uh, and then same with this um, straightener. This is just a small straightener and I don't need that size as well. Same with this one. Now this is a really good um, straightener. This is from Hot Tools. I'm going to take this as well to Goodwill because... So those ones are all going to go to Goodwill. Yay! And then these are accessories to my hair dryer that I just don't use. So I'm going to toss those. They're going to go... Oops, throw those in the trash. All righty, so now let's tackle this. Okay, this is where I keep, obviously, extra body lotions and stuff like that, which I'm not gonna use this, so I'll probably end up taking this to Goodwill. Um, these are razors I will definitely keep. Um, these are just like plastic bags, which are really good for traveling. Um, so I might keep those for traveling. Oh, look, I have an extra one of those. Wonderful. Um, oh, look, I have another one of these. Great. <laughs> um, okay, so look at all of these. These are body scrubs, which are really wonderful. So I think I'm going to keep these because I do like having body scrubs. So there's one. Here's, oh, a cinnamon pumpkin body scrub for the fall. Um, here's one apple harvest for the fall. Um, here's one Love and Sunshine Sugar Scrub for summertime. So I like that one. I'll put that one aside. I think, let's see, this one is a good one for summer. Um, I think I'll go ahead and keep this. These two kind of match. So I think I'll go ahead and keep these because I can actually use those in the shower now or I can take them with me on the trip. Um, this is a really nice thing to have. This is a shave gel. This is a nice little travel size shave gel. So I'm going to go ahead and keep that for Brian, which I need to clean out his side too. We won't be doing that today. So for now, I'm just going to set it up there. Okay. Um, I don't need this mirror anymore. So let's get rid of that. Um, this is body clear body wash. Ooh, Neutrogena. I think I should probably just keep all the body washes. I don't know. Um, white citrus. I have a ton of them. Um, this is going to go, this is a shimmer and shea, um, shimmer gel trash. Um, this is, um, instant comfort gel trash. Um, I'll go ahead and keep this because this one kind of matches the cinnamon pumpkin right here. So that's a nice little combo set. I'll keep that. So let's put the combo sets over here. Um, let's see, I have this beautiful day, which I love the way this one smelled. I always love that one. Um, this is Paris. Um, more, these are so old, you guys. Look how old these are. Um, this is the Rome Honeysuckle Amour. This is Apple Harvest. Do I have an Apple Harvest somewhere? Yep, there it is. There's another little set. So I have Apple Harvest right there. And then this one is Cashmere Glow. Um, this one is Seaside Pink Jasmine. Goodness, and this one is Bali Mango. Um, this is Jasmine Cherry Blossom. I'm tossing that because I don't like that scent. All right, so what do I have in here? I have more razors, which is a good thing. This is Capri Seaside Citrus. This is a body lotion. I'll probably just donate that to Goodwill. Um, and then this is a body lotion. Donating it. Body lotion. Donating it. This is an empty, oh, no, it's not empty. It's just like a small, um, like, first aid kit, which is really good to have, too, for when you're traveling, like, in your travel bag or whatever. Um, so I'm going to keep that out. And then there's are just extra razors, and then these are just, like, clips. I don't know what those are there for. All right, so let's put the razors back in here. So at least I know I have that. Um, and I actually like to, keep, I need to get a new one of these um, because this one actually is broken. The little handle's falling off of it. So 
I'm gonna go ahead and get a new one. So I'm thinking that I might be able to fit all of that stuff inside of here. And then that'll open up some space in my cabinet down there. So that's probably what I'm going right, to do. So doing. I'm actually just going to put this back in the, the cabinet like this. I'm not going to add this thing to it because it's just a pain in the butt to keep getting in and out of. So I actually made a lot of room here, a lot of progress. Um, I have some extra toothpaste and stuff in here that I'm going to keep in here. My makeup wipe removers that I'll keep in here. That's just extras. Um, I'm actually thinking that I might just eliminate this basket as well and just add all of the razors and stuff in here because it just makes it a little bit more you know less stuff less stuff less stuff the better right and then these clips I actually will probably just clip on there for now and then I'll just eliminate that basket and then this stuff this oh you know what now that uh ding dang now that I have another enough room in here those might because I'm not going to put them in the thingy they're going to stand up so I can eliminate this too Ooh, down to one. Okay, so another thing. I just fit all of this stuff inside of here. Since I'm not putting it inside this, which is a good thing because it um, wouldn't fit if I put those in here. So I'm just going to slide this back inside of there. I actually um, put all the razors and the extra toothpaste. I'm actually going to put the toothpaste down here. That would be perfect. These can go there. Perfect. And I'll just keep the razors separate because Brian's always like, where are the razors? So I'll just keep these separate. And then I actually just put my um, extra curling iron and stuff inside of here. This is wide enough where I can put my hair dryer in here as well and my other curling iron when I'm not using it. So that can go in there. This can go back there, which is nice. And then this, I'm just gonna lift up and put inside all of right. there. So I went ahead and added my hair dryer inside of here and my curling iron that I use all the time. I just put it in here. Razors are there. And this fits perfectly right there. Awesome. Now this cabinet is completely done. Alrighty, so before it starts raining, I'm gonna go ahead and take out that garbage bag that I filled up with all the stuff underneath my sink. And then I'm gonna call it a day. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up. And I will see you guys tomorrow in Wonderland. Bye.